So, somebody actually suggested that I play the Dreadout demo instead of Act 1. Because it, it looks different and a little more polished. And from what I can see, some aspects do look a little better. Yeah, the flashlight definitely looks a little better. We don't got that rainbow at the edges of it. Actually looks like a flashlight beam. Controls do seem a little bit smoother. At least I'm not jerking all around when I uh, turn. So let's be honest, it was a little sensitive in Act 1 and the rest of the Dreadout game. Apparently I don't have the glitching. And the camera doesn't seem to be as responsive either. But Linda herself does seem to look better. Alright, no flying but Oh, wait, there it is. Picture not enough for it. Or did it get it? That's right, Linda, close the door. Marzura. There she is. How you doing? You. What are you doing here? <laughs> Come on. Follow me. <laughs> Her audio is rather low, isn't it? Her voice tied to the music? Because I turned the music down. Well, that's different. You can definitely see the cat now. And it's got a little bit of a focus going on, too. Hey there, kitty. And there goes Zira. I don't think she was in the uh, Act 1, was she? Walking away from the door.
And we're back. Let's go and talk to her. Yeah, her audio is very low. the key to the main door. I don't hear the laughter of what's her name. The one that just got me in the window in the uh Oh, now I hear it. Very faint, but I think that was it. Can't, oh, there she is. Oh, another one? Okay, so now you're done. Or not. Or you are. What's his name up there? The giant Pokong. Up here, check out the candles. Take a picture that does nothing and head back. And now we 
take pictures of the candles again. I will say this seeg into the uh into the be to be continued for act 1 is a little better than the music they decided to use in act 1. Well, thanks for watching.